Hello friends. In our life every day we encounter a lot of situations when we have to decide whether we fight for something or we accept the situation and move on, so to say. Yeah? And this question is not always easy to answer. Actually, it's one of the most difficult questions. So today I will talk about how to deal in different situations, when to accept and when to fight for something. If you are new to this channel, I'm Nadia and here I talk about business and self-development and you get a video every week, so consider subscribing to my channel not to miss any videos. Don't forget to hit the notification bell so that you will not miss valuable information. So <clears throat> in case of this question, like how to deal in a particular situation, should you fight for the situation or should you accept it? It really depends on your values, on your goals in life, yeah? whether you are um, a consumer or a producer, so to say. Yeah? And I'm always the one who says yeah, it's great to be a producer, a giver, yeah? to give more than you take in this life in general, yeah? in any kind of situation, in any kind of relationship. Because in this case, actually, your life has meaning, yeah, you, you give something and you also leave something after yourself, you know, you leave something valuable behind, something good behind, make sure that it's good. Yeah, so it depends. But in general, you can say that there are conditions in life that you cannot really change, you yeah? You know, there are, for example, you want to become a mayor or a president of a country. Yeah? And uh, even if you have the qualities and so on, there are so many different conditions, different people involved, you know, politics, economics, and so on, that you cannot always control the situation, no matter how hard you try. Yeah? And at some point, you can actually let your ambitions go yeah? and concentrate on something else. In this case, it's really a good approach because you will not lose your energy and your potential uh, because if you are so ambitious, probably you have the potential to do something more than you're doing now, yeah? If you are looking for some such an important position, so to say, or such an important project. In this case, it's okay to accept the situation and to actually say, yeah, I, I tried my best, but I can see that I can use my energy in a different project and, yeah, just move on. A different kind of situation is when, uh, when you actually should not accept the situation, yeah? And uh, those situations are usually situations you are actually able to change but you do not always realize that it's important to do so. You don't feel the danger of the acceptance of such a situation. So usually it's like people give you some material things and you have to give something in return, something which is going against yourself against your values, yeah? against your self-respect and so on. And in this case, even though the situation may look so simple and so harmless, yeah? in this case, you should fight till the end. You should not accept such situation. Really fight till the end, literally, because, yeah, you know, till you die, because if you accept the situation, no matter how simple it looks like and um, innocent, so to say, you know. But if you stay in a situation which is working against you uh, as a personality and you actually accept it, you decided that this is okay, yeah, then you are basically destroying your personality, destroying your yourself. And uh, you become you know, completely dependent and no money in the world 
can become can make you happy after you make such a decision against yourself because you're going really against your true values your inner core self your self-respect again yeah your mm, conscience so really watch out for those situations and this is uh, basically you know if if uh, we talk about the first situation when you can't really uh, change the situations but you can try to fight it's also okay yeah because going beyond your comfort zone is uh, a good idea yeah i have a video on uh, why comfort zone ruins your life check it out after this this video and what i'm trying to say is that actually fighting till the end is always okay yeah it's just uh in case the conditions are bigger than you are then it's a little bit of waste of time can be but while fighting you at least train your muscles so it's not a complete lose anyway but the situations when you accept the situation those are can be dangerous Th those are potentially really dangerous so the main criteria here is whether you go against yourself in exchange of material things usually yeah? people do a lot of things in exchange of that you know they basically trade their mind or soul or whatever yeah they train themselves and after that they usually also get very sick in the way that they get, get depressions they can also get really seriously physically sick you know they don't feel any happiness and in your life i would recommend you to go for for happiness yeah for happiness and uh, especially for independence for being free you know because golden chains the golden chains have never proven to be a true solution yeah so the main thing is that you are fine with your own personality that with your own values that you fight for yourself because nobody else will yeah and this is your own responsibility to take care of yourself and to fight for yourself as long as you are 18 plus <laughs> and don't forget that there is always more options than you think in situations there is always more freedom that you can imagine so like if you have a situation uh, you can accept the situation if the conditions are bigger than you are or you can fight to you know to pursue your goals or you can leave the situation in this case you don't have to fight for it and in this case you don't have to accept it yeah so you just you are just out of it yeah? this would be the third option and another option is like if you cannot fight against something then you can become the leader of this movement and then direct the whole movement into different direction yeah this was would be of course a very great and skillful way of changing the conditions so my point is that there's always a way out there is always more freedom than you think than you can imagine there's always more options more solutions and yeah this is what i want you to get for this video that always go for more freedom for more independence for more happiness to be able to fight for yourself it's uh, important to be emotionally intelligent yeah I have a separate video on emotional intelligence I recommend you to watch after this video so that you are more capable of dealing with everyday situations and for basically fighting for your freedom and for your happiness I hope you like this video and i would like you to leave me a comment maybe you had some situations when you were not sure whether to accept it or not or maybe at the moment you have a such situation i would love to hear from you and i would love also to help you with that otherwise i'll 
also have a playlist of videos on self-development. You can also check them out after this video and enjoy my channel. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so that we can stay longer together.